there are two types of site web analytics reports. They are the following, traffic and inventory. For the traffic reports, there are the number of page views, the number of daily unique visitors. This report shows the number of unique visitors for the date range specified, the number of referrers. This shows the amount of traffic from external referrals. Top pages shows the most popular pages based on page views for the date range specified. Top visitors shows the top unique visitors to your website for the specified date range. Top referrers shows the top external web pages that refer traffic to your site. Top destinations shows the external web pages your visitors most frequently go to when they leave pages on your site. In top browsers, this report shows the internet browser types and versions most commonly used by visitors. The inventory reports, there's the number of sites, shows a trended daily snapshot of the number of sites in your site collection. Number of lists, shows a trended daily snapshot of the number of lists in your site collection. Number of libraries, shows a trended daily snapshot of the number of libraries in your site collection. Top site templates, shows the most popular site templates used to create sites in your site collection. Top site product versions shows the top site product versions based on the product version property of each site in your site collection. Top site languages shows the top site languages based on the number of sites created using each language. Top list templates. This report shows the most popular list templates used to create lists in your site collection. Top library templates. This report shows the most popular library templates used to create libraries in your site collection. And now we have a brief demonstration showing you how to run the site web analytics reports. In this example, we're going to show you how to run a site web analytics report. So the first thing we have to do is launch our site. In this example, it's intranet.contoso.com. We go to Site Actions, select Site Settings. Then under Site Actions, we select Site Web Analytics Reports. And these are our traffic reports for the site. These are our inventory reports for the site. And to launch a specific report, you simply click on it. So here's our top number of pages and then you can do further things to the report with the Analyze ribbon. And that's the Site Analytics Reports, Web Analytics Reports.